We on. Five bottles. <laughs> Didn't we say there were six, though? There were six. <laughs> but we did five bottles yesterday. Woo! Now? We brought out the old year with five bottles. Yes. We're bringing in the new year with one. <laughs> Here we go. We're doing the Moet Chandon Rosé Imperial. I love this. So it's actually kind of exciting that we saved the best for last. Well, we're not sure it's the best. Oh, we're that's right. We're going to taste this Because you did really like that... Uh, Villa Carson. Yeah, that was quite yummy. And they have a pink one too. We didn't get yes, the pink one. Yes, we did not. Um, but... The other part is this is a this is Pinot Noir, Pinot Meunier, and Chardonnay. Mm -hmm. It's Grand Cru, so it's their top grapes, mm -hmm. um, non vintage. Mm -hmm. um, I actually sort of saved this for the last because if I recall, this and had a sweetness. had a little residual sugar on it, which was nice. Yeah, um, just a hint. I don't know, you may have remembered last night, or you may not. Um, I think on bottle number five, I mentioned something about palate fatigue. Mm -hmm. um, your wine tasting, when you're um, drinking, eating, eating. You know, if you eat the same thing all day, it's going to start to mute and sort of taste all the same, even if you're tasting a whole bunch of different things. So, um, you know, you have to be weary aware of uh palate fatigue at any point so that is true and we drank a lot of bubbles last night we drank a lot of bubbles we ate a lot of animal protein with yes, butter we did. and we both lost weight we did that's a good we might diet. be on a new diet that's a good <laughs> diet program five bottles of bubbles filet mignon big ass filet mignon steaks yeah Dungeness crab. A plate full. Yep. And butter. Yes. Not a little bit of butter. I mean. A lot of butter. Butter. And we lost weight. Yep. <laughs> hey, that's the new diet. Here's to 2014, <laughs> right, baby? Yes. So this actually happens to be one of my favorite French champagnes here that Earl's going to open. I actually really love this. Um, first time we had it was at 1313, so we give them a shout out again. Um, we'd actually gone in there after wine tasting. They used to have a great bubbles bar. They've made it go away, which makes me sad. Um, but Al, the owner was in there this day and I said, you know, I, I feel like some bubbles cause we've been drinking red wine all day, we'll clean up the palate. I said, but I want something with a hint of sweetness. And he went, Ooh, I think I have something. And he came out with a split of this, just a little bottle, right? Um, and he said, I think you should try this, and opened it, and I, I fell in love. I mean, Earl was like, okay, my woman loves that that much. I better, like, scoop up every bottle Al has, which was only one other little split. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and, and then I stumbled upon it in the grocery store of all places in the locked cabinet. Um, you gotta so, be in the, you got to be in the good part of town for, for this. Bottom no, the lock we're cabinet. we're in the poor part of town, so they lock it because people steal the good shit. <laughs> um, and uh, saw it in there, and of course I just had to get it. So this one we've actually bought months ago and saved it for the New Year's celebration here. So um, hopefully we'll give a taste here. So here you find this story why Earl's off camera pouring. You guys didn't get to be a part of that experience. Um, Facebook decided that I must have been hacked last night because I did so much posting that they made me go, they shut down my account and made me go through all the security checkpoints to get back on. They ain't doing that to the NSA, though. Oh, yeah, the NSA knows everything we talked about, baby. Yeah, they do. Here's and two. I hope they, you know what, they was listening to us. We was drinking champagne. They was probably drinking coffee and water. Yep. Poor suckers. To our 2014, baby. 14! Hmm. You smell. Mm hmm You don't know? It's a little fruit. It might be the grape, but it just has a little unique uh, bouquet. 
the bubbles are settling in the glass still. Yes. Mmm. Mm. That's good. Is it good? Yeah. Why is it good? Um, different. I mean, from a lot of, I mean, the Bill of Cards some on was, was. Gorgeous. Excellent. I mean, that was, uh, that was on, that was on point. We drank a lot of really traditional French champagne last night. Brute style, yeasty, um, you know, subtle changes in fruit, but the Bellicart had that kind of peachy stone fruitness to it. It wasn't yeah. sweet. Yeah. It was but very it just, integrated. Yeah. It, very um, integrated. It was really nice. So. For sure. Ah, a nice lazy day at home. Yeah, I got to cook dinner still. Mm. Got a whole pot of collard greens going. Yes, you do. So good. It's almost got some honey, a little bit of honey and pear to it. No? Yes. So good. So if you find a bottle, treat yourself. You'll love it. All right. We signing out until Sunday, I guess. Number six. What's number six? Oh, for this the bottles. The six, this is <laughs> the sixth bottle. Wait, wait, how do you say six in French? You did all the other ones. You how do I say how do I say how do I say five? Lord. Sac cat that. That was four. Cat was four. Sac. No. Cock. Cock. That's what it was. <laughs> yes. Thank you to Michael and Tambra for that yes. one. Yes. Um, I don't know how you say six. So I thought you see. said it was something like um, like the Spanish version. Yeah, it is. They're both romantic languages, so it's... it's yeah, but cock, some... cock is not how you say five. <laughs> no, it sounds like that. But, you know. Thank you, Michael. See, you got me in trouble. They're going to probably ban us on YouTube. <laughs> and Facebook. Yes. So... All right. Peace out. Happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year.